Hi guys. Yesterday I recorded my second review. It turns out I can't transfer recordings that are over 10 minutes long or something, so I'm going to try to refilm this. The second review is on Bring It On by Beck Haikyung, and I remembered to say the title this time. Sorry I didn't say the title of the last review. Bring It On, it's another rom-com. It's about a girl named Miha, that's her right there, who is a tomboy, and a bishinen, which I believe means pretty boy, kind of like Tamaki Senpai from Warren High School Host Club, which makes sense because he looks just like him, called Siangsa. He is a lot like, in my opinion, a combination between Shigure from Fruits Basket and Tamaki Senpai from or in High School Host Club, so he's pretty funny. This is more comedy than romance, so you know there is stuff in there that guys would find funny, but in general, girls will probably appreciate it more. It's a Korean manhwa, so that means that some of the drawing techniques and the appearance of the characters will be different. For example, the eyes aren't as big. The necks and limbs are a lot longer in the characters. All the characters are a lot taller as well. It is kind of different, read differently to the way manga is read. Manga is read tradi traditionally with this would be the cover and this would be the back. I would definitely recommend this manhwa. I think it's very good. I would probably give it an 8 out of 10 for that reason and the fact that I prefer manga. I personally am probably being a bit biased because I prefer manga. I prefer the look of characters like Toru or Misha or Shia from Pita 10. Um, the manhwa is in four parts, but I personally feel that if there were any more books than that, the story would just drag on too long. It wouldn't really be as good. With the four books that there are, there are still a lot of twists and turns, and you're still left wondering what's going to happen next. But the story gets told very well. I personally don't think it drags. I think it is pretty good, so yeah, I would definitely recommend it to people. Um, yeah, any suggestions? If anyone has a manga or something that they haven't read before and they want an opinion of it, if I don't have it, I'll just look it up on MangaFox, so feel free to suggest <laughs> titles. And if you guys have read it, tell me what you think down below, and yeah, if you haven't read it, do you want to now? Because uh, I managed to convince somebody, Lucy, to read Fruits Basket after watching my Fruits Basket review, so yay, another otaku! Okay, bye guys.